My name is Reiko Yoshida. I'm working for the section of Intangible Heritage of UNESCO. And I'm an assistant program specialist. Uh, the convention you are referring to is called the Convention for the Safeguarding of Intangible Cultural Heritage, which, has a, which was adopted by UNESCO, uh, UNESCO General Conference in October 2003. And how can PGIS good practices can, be, can benefit from the convention uh, once convention enters into force, with the ratification by the 30 countries, uh, the convention will set up a fund through which international cooperation can be sought. And the convention, uh, Article 25 to 28, talks about the usage, potential usage of the, uh, of the fund and um, inventory making of intangible cultural heritage is one of the obligations that state parties to the convention has to do and um, drawing up of inventory, inventory of intangible cultural heritage is one of the ways that the fund can be used so this is how the PGIS good practice can potentially benefit from the convention intangible cultural heritage is essentially the heritage of the people at the local level and it is important, we believe that it is important to safeguard intangible cultural heritage because it is important to the people.